In this video, I'm gonna be showing you the most easiest way to make a rhythm on your iPhone. Go to your iPhone browser. In browser, search for canva.com and just go to Canva website. If you're first time here, then tap on login and then go ahead and sign up or just sign into your account with your Google account. Once you successfully signed in to canva.com, in this search template, type here RISM and search for RISM. As a search results, here you will find lots of premium quality, free and paid RISM template. You can just pick any of the free template to customize according to your needs. Let's pick this RISM for example. Just tap on the RISM. And you directly jump into the Rhythm editing page. Here, let's tap on the name. And now, double tap on the name or text. And then you will be able to easily customize the text from here. That's how you can just go ahead and select any text box to edit just like this. And here you get the format box here you get lots of options to customize your resume now i will show you how to replace your image in resume so tap on the image tap on delete again tap here sorry for my mistake first of all select the image and here tap on replace and tap on upload files select device photo library and from your computer you can select a different image tap on done and it may take some moments to upload the image here so once uploaded select the image and we can see the image successfully replaced so that's how you can just select any of the text or text box box and you'll be able to customize the text box font and text styles font size text color format advanced effects and once your editing finished tap on share tap on download and file type you can select jpg png pdf and I'm selecting here PDF and then just clicking on download and that's how you will be able to download your RISM on your iPhone. Tap on download, tap on share. Here you have to tap on more and tap on save to files. Select a location and just tap on save. Now go to your files app and navigate to the folder and here we can see the pdf that i just created using canva and that's how you can actually do it